Who did you want to nominate for the good deed recognition? Um, I'd like to nominate Dr. Lev for all of his physics, health, and inspiration. Okay, I will see what I can do. Dr. In Yisrael, seasoned for 18 years, he felt swell. When we got married to Nira in 1960, they had Ronnie and Ori. He got his master's degree. It took six years studying nuclear physics, predicting nuclear masses of unstable elements. And after Hebrew, you still no time to party, serving two and a half years in the army. Then back to school, Tel Aviv University. He got his PhD in the 70s. Back when we still used hand crank adding machines. Computers were only starting to come on the scene. He literally cranked out his masters, I reckon. It took years to do what we now do in seconds. That didn't stop him, no dear ladies and gents In case you need more evidence His dissertation defies summation It's unforbidden decays of isospin and a log resonance He didn't stop there, there was too much to do After his doctorate in 72 He made his way to USA for a Wayne State postdoc Recession, he continued to rock with another postdoc at U Maryland. Then an awesome job, he proceeded to land with a new thing called computing. He got in at the ground floor with a programming job at four. He was leading the nation in innovation, doing crash and power flow simulation. His algorithms, they had rhythm, and he was so in the flow when he did them. His coding stylings wrote for miles in, simulating the electric piling. Lithium ion, megatrion, then designed the fourth focus stylon. Range prediction, his program fiction had to take into account all the friction. Some say retirement, I say inspirement. In 2012, he said it, well, now I'm trying. He's taking classes, he's kicking asses, and as a gift to us, he's still teaching the masters and needs some help. Help you, he can. You know that everyone says he's a brilliant ass man. Dr. Lev, you see, with a PhD, and it brings it free. He gets up early to help people like me in the WB. He wrote a program to make groups for my laboratories. He helped build cars that run electrically. He loves to visit his grandkids down in DC. He's not and scar, he's just being of service. The man's fully alive and he's clear on his purpose. Dr. Lev, thank you, Dr. Lev, Dr. Lev.